Yo, yo, what's cracking, YouTube? It's your boy, Professor Crypto. Got another hot crypto class for you guys today. This one's on fire. You guys already know anything we bring on the channel, it's got the heat, got the potential, and it definitely should be watched. This one is so different, guys. Without further ado, let's jump right into it. Class is now in session. This one is called BTC ST. Guys, we did an introductory video on BTC ST a couple weeks weeks ago they've been doing very well so far for anyone who doesn't remember what they're all about btc st is a collateral backed asset guys this standard hash rate group the community organizers pioneered issuing hash rate backed assets in this case bitcoin directly onto a DeFi platform and guys as a result btc st provides the market with premium collateral to further expand the DeFi ecosystem since its launch in early january guys of this year the community led project has also enabled its holders to participate in the governance process such as voting on upgrades into the decentralized app itself the btc st d app was deployed onto the binance smart chain because it provides a low cost user experience without sacrificing transparency that miners demand they have a little video on their website guys i want to play that for you just so we could get a better grasp of what they're all about Mining is one of the largest cryptocurrency mining power provider in the world. We believe BTSST has connected Bitcoin mining to the DeFi world. With BTSST, we can first earn real BTC where DeFi native staking. Now, we can stake BTSST to earn synthetic proof of work assets. This is a logical step for BTSST and a bridge for Bitcoin to enter DeFi. Hi, I'm Zhang Zhuo, CEO of BTC.talk. BTC.talk is one of the earliest and largest mining pool and proprietary miner in the world. We have world class experience in the operation of mining facility. BTC ST has turned mining machine into high liquidity assets as green scan as to Bitcoin. With the coming sensitivity assets green. BTC ST will become the foundation of defined innovation. We believe this is the logical next step of BTC ST. Hello, I'm Kathy Yu, CMO of Easy to Mine. Easy to Mine is where most of the largest industrial miners purchase second hand mining machines from. We are the ultimate mining machine supplier. We are also well known for our 99% mining, half time for our own mining hosting office and our global client base. We believe a project like BTCST should focus on decentralization of hash rate solving. We are glad to join this project as a member. We also believe BTCST should use its hash rate advantage to create synthetic assets. This is a sensible model and offers a much stronger value support than current designs in the market. Hello, I'm Renee Hennen, CEO of Genesis Mining. Genesis Mining is the largest cloud mining company in the world, and we look back on eight amazing years in the cryptocurrency and mining industry. The Bitcoin standard hash rate token is really exciting. PTCST expands the Bitcoin ecosystem and brings Bitcoin to DeFi. It has the potential to add a lot of value to the DeFi universe. I'm Nico, the manager of Hengjia Group. Hengjia Group is the operator of some of the largest hydropower cryptocurrency mining facilities in the world. We are experts in securing stable power supply and operating industrial scale mining facilities. We have entered the blockchain industrial in 2014 and now has more than 20 big data centers in many cities. And we also set up technology research and development center in Beijing and Shenzhen. 
We are the largest domestic partner of U.S. start listed companies, Jiangnan Technology and Bifang International. Also, we are the largest energy corporation institution of the blockchain chip manufacturer, Bitmain and Shenma Technology. We congratulate the innovation of the BTCSD project. We first started to support BTCSD as the benchmark hash rate token. We now will work with the BTCSD project to improve its ecosystem of synthetic assets and bring Bitcoin to default. We support BTCSD. Chair. We support BTCST. We support BTCST. We at Genesis are really happy and proud to support BTCST. We support BTCST. For the meat and potatoes of today's video guys, I want to go over a couple medium articles that BTC SD has published. This one most recently guys was published 5 days ago. Very important article guys and the title reads, BTC SD celebrate what's been delivered and what's to come. The article goes on to explain to the community, BTC SD has become a benchmark protocol to bring Bitcoin to DeFi since their debut on Binance launch pool. With the support of over 12% of Bitcoin's global hash rate, BTCST is now the clear leader in the field of hash rate tokens. New members to their community have been requesting additional information on their recent upgrades. So they want to take this opportunity to review what they have built and what's to come. The first thing, BTCST was delivered. They delivered the following based on community feedbacks and votes. The SCP-1 BTC reinvestment pool. This is where you stake to mine BTC, but convert BTC mining rewards to BTC ST for easier reinvestment. STP3 gas fee optimization. This implementation of STP3 has resulted in 60% reduction in Binance Smart Chain network fees on average, which makes the staking of small amounts of BTC ST doable. The STP4 redenomination. To implement their DeFi roadmap and to make BTC ST more accessible to new members of their community. BTCST has completed a 1 to 10 re-denomination, keeping the valuation unchanged, such as that 1 BTCST became 10. The market response to the successful completion of the community-driven re-denomination has been overwhelmingly positive. The SCP-5 stopped new issuance of BTCST, the Maya proposal. To ensure the smooth launch of their synthetic asset platform, the community has passed the vote to stop new issuance of BTCST. The total circulation of BTCST will now stay at 15 million. STP6 Bitcoin initial liquidity and airdrop parameters. Archimedes proposal. In this landmark proposal, guys, BTCST proposed to implement T protocol to empower users to stake BTCST in return for synthetic assets. The first T asset to be synthetically mined by staking BTCST is the T Bitcoin, a synthetic Bitcoin that brings all Bitcoin to DeFi, guys. You can see that protocol white paper for more details. Examining what's to come, they're progressing steadfastly with their roadmap to unleash the full potential of hash rate assets for DeFi, guys. The preview for their community of what to come. The STP7 Authority Oracle for NFTs. This BTC ST observes that solely an ultimate source of the truth of NFT authority, records are stored solely in the NFT issuance contracts. NFT holders therefore must trace that the private key holders with admin access to these contracts data would not irresponsibly or recklessly tamper with these records, guys. The TSDR synthetic asset peg to FX reserve assets. This standard hash rate group is working to implement the T protocol to synthesize additional assets. For example, guys, the BTCST users will be able to stake BTCST to synthesize TSDR, a synthetic asset pegged to the pool of FX reserve assets. The T Bitcoin V2, the restorative rebase supported by the protocol's built-in open market purchase mechanism. T Bitcoin has shown strong price peg since its launch. 
the team is working to make Bitcoin even better with T-Bitcoin V2, which will replace deflationary rebase with a restorative rebase mechanism that A, will not diminish the balances of T-Bitcoin addresses that remain transactionless during rebase periods and two will reward purchases of T-Bitcoins at the same time. T-Bitcoin as primary asset in the ecosystem. In addition to collaborations with other leading projects on the adoption of T-Bitcoin, they are building a T-ecosystem that will rely on T-Bitcoin as the primary asset. Among other things guys, T-Bitcoin will be used for minting and authority validation through T-Sage of NFTs payment of electricity utility fees that would otherwise be deducted from BTC mining rewards and collateralization in TSDR pools. They then thank the community for their support guys on their journey to bringing Bitcoin to DeFi. Last article I want to show you today guys is STP7 Sage proposal, the authority oracle for NFTs. This article was published on April 6th guys when we examine the purpose of this scp7 announces tsage for the community voting tsage is a form of authority oracle for nfts intended to be blockchain infrastructure to cryptographically trace nft authority if stp7 passes tsage will be launched via btc std app v2 by the end of may 2021 details the btc st has implemented t protocol to empower users to mine t bitcoin their first synthetic asset while the BTC ST team and their miners and mining pool partners work towards further implementation of T protocol to mint non fungible tokens, they observe that the current NFT mint schemes are in the need of authority oracles. The article goes on to explain that they observe that the sole and ultimate source of the truth for NFT authority records, which are data establishing the link between minted tokens and assets, these tokens purport to inextricably represent are stored solely in the nft issuance contracts nft holders therefore must trust that the private key holders with admin access to these contract data would not irresponsibly or recklessly tamper with the records in other words data immutability isn't sufficiently improved or foolproof by the use of nft technologies in most cases btc st proposes t sage to solve this issue because they are an authority oracle for the nft available for integration by any platform intending to mint nfts t sage rolls up and preserve the authority records of minted NFTs in the Coinbase text of Bitcoin and other temper resistant public ledgers. They then to go on explain how TSage works. I encourage you to review that on your own time, guys, if it's something that you're interested in. Shout out to all my students. I love you. Group hug. Shout out to the Crypto Class Gang. Shout out to the Lambo Gang. Shout out to the Whale Gang. Shout out to the Hotto Gang. Thank you for always your continued support, guys. I really appreciate it. If you guys enjoyed this video, please be sure to smash that like button for me and drop a comment in the comment section below. Please remember guys, we are an impartial channel, so whether your opinion is negative or positive, we'd be more than happy to hear it. That being said guys, class is now dismissed. We'll see you in our next video. Professor Crypto out.